Hello and welcome back to the channel. In this episode, I'm going to share with you all, or I'm going to show you how you can clear the break service notification on your BMW using Beamer code and this adapter. So stick around, take a cup of coffee, relax and enjoy. All right, first has a disclaimer. This episode is not sponsored by any of the tools I'm going to use. I think it makes a lot of sense for you all to know what tools I'm using and where you can purchase them. Now I'm going to use this adapter, uh, the adapter, what you will need. So what, what you will need for this job is this adapter. Uh, let me focus, let me focus. Yep, it's called V-Linker BM Plus. Vlinker BM Plus Pro Professional. This is what you need. It's very cheap. The link is in the description below where you can get it. And the software, we're going to use the software. And this software, you can get it on App Store, which is Google Play or, or, or App Store for Apple. You download the application for free, but you have to buy a license. So I, I don't have a, a promotion a promotion code because this, this is not sponsored, but you can go and grab yourself a license so that you'll be able to do everything that I'm going to do in this episode. Now, to get started, first you want to put your car on accessory mode. You just press one. All right, the car is on, it's on accessory mode. And I want to show you what I meant by clearing the brake service notification. If you go to your iDrive, uh, let me go back, let me go back, let me go back. Okay, so you are on your iDrive and you go to your vehicle info, you click on that and then you go all the way to vehicle status. You click on that and you scroll all the way to service required you click on that and then it's will you will see we have the engine oil while well, the car is out it's just asking me to do the, to change the engine oil uh that's not a big deal but um here it says brake fluid well why do i have this brake fluid if you if you have been following along um i've just replaced their I upgraded my brake system. So I got new calipers, new brake pads, and I had to bleed, I have to bleed the system. And after I did that, uh, especially with all the, the beamers, uh, you need to clear this code, uh, this code just to, to let the car know that you have done it. So because everything was almost, uh, I did it myself, so I don't have all the tools that they're I don't have all the tools that the dealer uses to to do this job. However, um, you know, with the the with the help of this this guy here, and also the the Bima link, uh, which which you downloaded from the App Store, will help us to clear this. So I'm gonna show you step by step how to do that. Now that we have the car on accessory mode, make sure you just put your seat belt on so the car won't go on sleep. So you on and um, you open up your app. Oh, first, before you open your app, you want to plug this on the ODB port. So you know where the ODB port is? It's, uh, it's underneath, underneath the here, somewhere down here. This is where we're going to plug it in. So I'm going to plug this um, underneath there on the ODB port. All right, now that we have now that we have plugged in the uh, the adapter on the ODB port, our next step is to open up Beamer Link. When you're doing this type of work, I highly encourage you to turn off your data, meaning uh, turn on your airplane airplane mode. This will help you not to interfere whenever you're flashing the ECU. It won't interfere with uh, maybe you get a call comes in or you get some notification comes in that may interrupt the uh, the that may inter interrupt the operation. So you don't want that to happen. So uh, you don't want that to happen. 
Now, uh, turn off, turn off data and then turn on the airplane mode and start doing this. All right, guys, you saw yourself how easy that was in just few clicks and less than a minute, we clear the notification we had. So look at, if you can see, look, we only have the engine oil. I didn't do the engine oil. Like I said, I still have to do the service because the last time I did it was last year in November. So I need to do the engine. So I didn't clear this one. But as you can see, with less than a hundred bucks, we were able to just clear everything. As you can see, we had a new, it was saying to replace the brake fluid. We clear it, everything is gone. Leave the comment below if you have any questions. It was so easy to clear this and uh, stay for more tip on the channel. Until next time, see you. Bye-bye.